Hello to everyone. The title of our project is Live Human Detection Remote Controlled Robot using C2000. It consists of two models. One is robotic control model. The robotic control model will be used by the person who will be operating the robot from remote location. The other is the robotic model. The robotic vehicle will move in disaster affected area to detect alive human. First, let's see the robotic control vehicle model. First, let's see the robotic control model. This is a voltage regulator circuit. Here we used IC7805 IC to regulate a 5 volt supply uh, which gives uh, power to controller, trans receiver circuit, LCD display. This is TV monitor. This is 2.4 GHz radio receiver. This is power up by AC DC adapter which gives 9 volt supply. This model consists of 433 MHz RF transmitter and receiver. This RF transmitter consists of HT12EIC which encodes the data to be transmitted. The RF transmitter in this model transmits the data regarding the direction of the robot. The RF receiver consists of HT12DIC which decodes the data being received. The RF receiver in this model receives data when the PR sensor in the robotic vehicle detects human presence. For controlling the movement of the robot from remote lo location, four switches are used. These switches are used for moving the robot in forward, reverse, right turn and left turn and it is connected to the C2000 launch pad. The C2000 launch pad is programmed to transmit desired data when different switches are pressed for different directions. When the PER sensor in the robotic vehicle When the PER sensor in the robotic vehicle detects the human, it will transmit the data to the robotic control model. The receiver in this model receives this data and the decoded data will be given to GPIO pin of C2000 launch pad which then displays the alert information in the LCD display. The LCD display used here is 2 cross 16 LCD display. The 8 data pins of LCD display is connected to GPIO 027. A 3 inch TV monitor is used to view the video in front of the robotic vehicle. It is attached to a radio receiver which receives the video transmitted by the wireless camera present in the robotic vehicle. Now let's see the robotic vehicle model. Here we used 12 volt battery. The 12 volt is converted into 5 volt by the IC7805. By using this 5 volt, we are power upping the circuit such as the MSB430 controller, relay circuit, receiver, transmitter and PAR sensor. The robotic vehicle consists of 4 wheels. Two of the wheels is attached to two DC gear motors and the remaining two wheels are free running wheels. This model also consists of 433 MHz RF transmitter and receiver. The RF receiver in this model receives the data regarding the direction control which is sent by the transmitter in robotic control model. The RF transmitter in this model will send the data only when the PR sensor detects the human. The PR sensor is the main part which detects alive human. Human body at normal temperature emits infrared radiations at an approximate wavelength of 10 micrometers. These IR radiations are used by the PR sensor to detect alive human body. The detection range of PR sensor is 7 meters. When the PR sensor senses these IR radiations emitted by human body, it will produce an output of plus 5 volt. This output is given to the MSB430 launch pad used in this program. The MSP430 is programmed such that when this 5 volt from PR sensor is received, it will transmit data to the robotic control model through RF transmitter. This transmitter encodes the data and sends the data to the robotic control model. This data will be received by the receiver in robotic control model, which then gives alert information. The two DC gear motors are connected to MSP430 through this relay circuit. 
For forward direction, both the DC gear motors are supplied by plus 5 volt. For reverse direction, both the DC gear motors are supplied by minus 5 volt. For right turn, only left motor is supplied by 5 volt and right motor is given 0 volt. For left turn, right motor is connected. Let us see the demonstration. Here we used Code Composer Studio. The program is dumped in C2000 controller. For forward direction, forward switch is pressed. For reverse direction, reverse switch is pressed. For left turn, left switch is pressed. For right turn, right switch is pressed. Let's see the working of the wireless robot movement. When forward switch is pressed, the robot moves in forward direction. When reverse switch is pressed, the robot moves in reverse direction. For left turn, left switch is pressed. For right turn, right switch is pressed. When robot directs a person, we can see a video in the TV monitor. A message alert can be viewed in LCD monitor. The message viewed as emergency alert human found. Then the helpers can direct the humans and they can help them. Let us see the movement of the robot in wireless. Robot moves in reverse direction. Now robot moves in left turn. We can get an instant uh, movement in wireless. Robot moves in right turn. Now move up, robot moves in forward direction. It moves in reverse also. Now it's turning left turn. It moves in forward direction and also in reverse. It moves in left turn, then right turn. The images can be viewed in uh, camera monitor.